Hi, I'm Rosa. Thanks for joining me. I thought today I'd do a what's in my handbag. I thought that kind of video might be fun, so come along as I show you what I have in my handbag. This is the handbag I've been using for the last couple days. Um, it's a travel bag by Bagalini or a travel type handbag. And the reason, it's a crossover and the, or can be used as a crossover, but the reason I am trying it out is I'm checking to see if it's going to be big enough to take on an upcoming trip. And I've used it in the summer when it's real hot, just want to get different places for work with a, without having a, any type of bag that could get anything on it in the heat of the summer. Um, but now I'm trusting it out for travel. And I actually bought this at Costco uh, because it looked good. It looks a little small, but as I'm trying it, it might be good enough for a trip. Um, and the reason I want I want something big enough that can hold everything I need for travel, but I need something small and lightweight enough so that my back doesn't hurt. Even though I'd like to take a fancier bag or a prettier bag, just this black bag and this type of material that is water resistant um, seems, or it looks like it will work just fine. This bagalini came with this little wristlet. Um, it clips inside the bag or you can clip it to itself as a wristlet. Um, and you can use this as a wallet. It's RDFI, uh, and I've used it as a wristlet. It's big enough to hold my iPhone. I have a 13, and it fits just fine along with a couple items. So I actually like this. Uh, I'm not using this right now with the purse, so let me show you what's inside the handbag. One of the features that I like about this handbag and that I look for in almost every bag, and it's quite difficult to find, but I like the inside lining of the bag to be a different color. And the reason I like the inside lining to be a different color is I want to be able to find my things when I'm looking in there quickly. And it helps when the inside is a different color than the outside. So you see on this bag, it has a nice pocket here. It's, a, it's magnetic. And I have my phone in here. I don't have it in here right now, but it fits in there. And I also have this uh, because if I take off my eyeglasses I don't want to scratch them in my purse which I've done before so I just carry one of these cheap little uh, eyeglass holders to hold my reading glasses or everyday glasses when I put them in my handbag because sometimes I'll take them off and put on my sunglasses and I need something to put my eyeglasses in so that's all I have in this front pocket it goes all the way well and a tissue it goes all the way to the very bottom there's plenty of room the front zippered pocket has a key holder. It says for life's journey, life's journeys, and it snaps and you can put your keys on there, which is great, or anything else you want to clip to inside this front pocket. It makes it easy just to unzip this and you know where your keys are at all times. And then in here, I just have my earbuds, and a chapstick or a lip balm. But you can see it, it also, the pocket also goes to the very bottom and it is that, that I'd call it periwinkle inside. So that's what I have in here so far. This back pocket also goes all the way to the bottom and it's great for putting something in there quickly. It has a snap closure, but the snap is magnetic. So it makes it really easy to get in and out of. Now, the inside is, like I said, that same color. It has a zip pocket on the back inside, or the inside back. And it goes all the way to the bottom as well. And I just have a mirror because it has a magnifying side that I love using for makeup or to tweeze my eyebrows. I also carry a pair of scissors, a couple tubes of lipstick, some tweezers, and can't ever have enough tweezers. Two sets of tweezers in this back pocket. They're easy to find. Now there are two drop-in pockets right in front of the zip-up pocket. In here I have sunglasses. They also go all the way down eyeglass cloth cleaner, 
a backup battery, a cord, and a collection of pens and markers. It seems excessive, but I use these in my notebook and planning notebooks. In the main pocket of the bag, I have my little work notebook that I carry everywhere, or most everywhere, and this lug wallet. This isn't my preferred wallet, but I've been carrying it since this past summer because it was easy to get in and out of as I'm rushing along to do something. It has a little part here that you can use as a wristlet. Works great for just running in and out of the grocery store. It zips so everything is contained inside the wallet. And I'm, I'm going to change the wallet out. It's just something I haven't done. And you can see there's plenty of room. So like I said, I'm testing this bag out to see if I like it for travel. And I'm going to also put it on and show you what it looks like on. Here are the contents of my handbag, what I'm currently carrying, just so you can see the overview. Uh, I probably need to carry a tube of mascara and a couple other beauty items, some lotion in there, but it will certainly fit. There's plenty of room in this bag. So I'm gonna load it back up and show you how it looks. Two other things I want to show you about this bag is the hardware. It's not flimsy. It's quite beefy and nice, both on the zippers and the hardware to hold the strap as well. And the strap's not too large. And the hardware, it's not too big and too heavy but it's not flimsy it, it, it has a nice piece of hardware that you can grab and pull here's a little so you can see it a little better and one thing that i didn't show you this is where the wristlet gets attached or that that extra little bag so you can just attach that right there use it as your wallet it fits even with my other wallet and all the other stuff I have in there. But you could change everything out and use this. And when you need to pull out your wallet, it's still attached to your bag. So I think that's a nice feature. And the hardware on this as well is nice. It feels solid. Here it is on. It's not as wide, works really well. It's fully extended on the strap. I am 5'6", so fits in a perfect spot. It's very comfortable. Thanks again for joining me. I hope you enjoyed my video and would consider subscribing or hitting the like button. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.